Hey, if you want to lock your apps with the password on the Samsung Galaxy S23 FE, first of all, uh, you have to go to the settings. So I'm going to show you how to do this step by step. So open the settings and here we have to scroll down until we find the security and the privacy. And here we have to focus on the secure folder. Right now, for sure, I'm going to uninstall it just to show you how to do this step by step. Yeah, I'm going to get rid of that. And right now, as you can see, the secure folder it doesn't appear anymore. So uh, let's go back to the settings, open the security and the privacy, and then go into our secure folder. And here, uh, if you are not logging with your Samsung account or the Google account, you have to be logging on your phone with this one of this account. And then when you do this, you have to click continue, read all of these permissions, then click continue one more time. And right now it will automatically create this secure folder. So now, as you can see, it will keep our apps and our other data into this folder. And to access this folder, we have to input our password that we will set up after this uh, creating process. <clears throat> so it will take around uh, a dozen of the seconds. So don't worry, it's not complicated process. And here we are, as you can see, first we can set the lock screen type. So in my case, it will be simple pattern. Just to show you how it looks, we have to click continue and we have to draw it one more time. We can uh, turn on the reset with the Samsung account. So it's useful when you, for example, forgot your password. But I'm gonna skip this step. Actually, I don't need it because it's only small preview of this uh, to this video. Here we can also turn on the fingerprints so we can unlock with your fingerprint sensor. And then when you set up everything, you can click next. And as you can see right here, we've got the secure folder. When you tap on the plus, you can also add additional apps right here. So I'm gonna add all my apps and also we can download apps from the Play Store or Galaxy Store and you will be still able to add them into this secure folder. Then click add. And as you can see, you can find here all our applications. So right now when I turn it off, and when I try to open this circuit application, I have to go to the secure folder and then I can open the YouTube. Of course, normally when you close everything, lock your screen, you will have to input the password. So take a look. As you can see right now, to enter the application, we have to input the password. When I open it in the background, close it and open it in the background, it's, it's without the password. So to get this password back, you have to go to the settings. You have to go to the privacy and the security. Go to the secure folder. And here we have to find the apps settings. No, it wasn't here. Uh, there was the lock type, I guess. No. Auto lock secure folder. Yeah. Uh, each time I leave the application. So right now, uh, let's open this YouTube. And as you can see right now, the password appears. And by the way, if you are wondering if the search that you are making right here appears also in the normal application without this password, the answer is no. I just make the search, the S23 FE, as you can see, it appears right here. But then when I open the normal YouTube on the phone, I don't have the searches anymore. So yeah, that's all for this video right now. Please subscribe to my channel and bye bye.